Welcome to Joel Coliseum. We're on Championship Sunday. There is more than just football on the minds of fans here along Tobacco Road. Here in Winston-Salem, North Carolina College Hoops will take center stage as the second-ranked Cavaliers look to extend a nine-game winning streak. Standing in their way, it is the Demon Deacons of Wake Forest. At the top of the arc, it's Crawford feeding Wilbekin on the near wing right. He's defended by Kyle Guy. Works around the Thompson screen. Now takes it into the lane. Backs it out. Now the pass to the near wing right. On the dribble drive, Wilbekin at the top of the arc puts up a jump shot, and he knocks this one down. And Wake Forest will strike first. He feeds Guy back out to midcourt to tie Jerome. Now seven to shoot. Jerome crossing over on his man. Now drives in on Thompson. Puts up a tough shot. Gets it to go on the floater outside of the lane to the right. Here's Kyle Guy with a nice feed inside to Diakite, who repays the favor, gliding inside for the easy finger roll. A nice dish. Virginia 3 of 7 from the floor. Kyle Guy's got it at the top of the arc. Driving in the low block. The round more was between him and the rim, so he steps back a couple feet and knocks down the baseline jumper from 15 feet out. Pull up jumper from the right baseline. DeAndre Hunter knocks down his first of the night. Devin Hall fake the shot, now passes off to Hunter. Hunter knifes his way inside, lost the basketball, but recovers as he shovels it back out to Guy with six to shoot. Kyle Guy, dribble drive on Woods, takes it in traffic, shot block. Hunter tries to muscle one up, that hangs on the rim, wouldn't go, but Jack Salt tips it right back up and in. On the ensuing possession, Crawford dumps it left of the lane to Moore. The double team arrives in the form of Hunter and Salt, that forces the errant pass to Guy. Guy feeds ahead to Nigel Johnson, takes it to the rack and leaves it in. Cavaliers asserting themselves. It's a seven-point lead for Virginia, and the Cavaliers on an 8-0 run over the last three minutes and 23 seconds. Wake Forest working the basketball around. Top of the arc with 10 to shoot. Dribble drive, pull-up jumper from Childress, and he knocks it down just inside the free throw line. DeAndre Hunter shows what he can do with his foot on the three-point line as he knocks down the pull-up jumper from the right wing. Going the other way, it's going to be Crawford now. Crawford passes out of a double team, and he sets up the open teammate for the dunk as Olivier Saar sends it down with a two-hand dunk. Hunter, jab step, driving inside, pull-up jumper with a hand in his face, and he hits it anyway from right of the lane about 15 feet out. That's a tough shot. DeAndre Hunter, the only player for Virginia to have scored more than once. Guy ahead fake drives into the paint as his pocket picked by Crawford. Crawford's off and running the other way. Wilkins in pursuit, can't catch up, and there's the lay-in. Wake Forest on the ensuing possession now. Leading 30 to 27, 16-21 to play in the second half. Here's a near turnover, and it will be turned over. Crawford had it poked away. The feet ahead to Nigel Johnson. He takes off and sends it down with a two-hand jam. It's back to a one-point game. Couple head fakes in, slashes his way right down the lane for the easy lane. It's a three-point lead, and that run is now up to eight as Wilkins gets his first points of the game. On the other end of things, Childress around the big screen, spinning his way in traffic, kisses it in to snap the run for Virginia. Back out top to Nigel Johnson. Johnson with a right-hand dribble, feeds underneath. He gives it to Wilkins. He feeds out to Guy, and Guy rips the cords with a three-pointer from the left wing. Johnson rifles the pass to Guy on the left wing. Guy's defended tightly by Mitchell. Back out top to Johnson. Sends a rocket down low to Hunter. Hunter working on his man. Lays it in off the window in the low block. He is a threat to score to be sure. He's got eight points so far in this game. Now on the drive. Diving and falling. Just getting rid of the basketball. Childress gives it to Crawford. Childress gets it back. He gets alone for three. And hands it from the near corner left. So Cavaliers with the basketball. The one point lead as we pick it up. 7.42 to play. Ty Jerome got it at the top of the arc. On the left hand dribble. Feeds out top. DeAndre Hunter alone from three, and he knocks it down. That's exactly what we were talking about. This time, DeAndre comes through for the Hoos, and they stretch it to a four-point lead. Cavaliers by four, led for most of the second half, but have not led by more than seven. Here's a pass into the left side. A wide open look, and Devin Hall buries it. So much for the Hoos missing open looks. They've hit back-to-back -back threes, and that lead is now out to seven once again. Six to shoot now. Jerome, a head fake, passes to Wilkins. He's going to have to try another shot from outside. Can't get it to go, but Hunter uses the lone hand up there high to tap it right back up and in. Here's Hall. 
Virginia by five. He drives baseline, passes out. DeAndre Hunter squeezes up another three, and he splashes it through. Smiles at his bench as he backpedals the other way. DeAndre Hunter making his imprint on yet another game as Virginia has stretched to its largest lead of eight. As the final seconds tick off the clock into chance of UVA on the road, Virginia is into the win column for a tenth straight time. Our final score, number two, Virginia 59, Wake Forest 49.